part six of my building the black pearl and this is the all scenario version it's gotten a little slow and I'll show you why here in just a second one of the items is the gun ports and the instructions say make sure that you clean these out and get them all nice and square it doesn't mention putting any uh, black walnut framing but I went ahead and did that so I've got that completed I uh, just recently sanded them. One of the top blocks fell off of this one in sanding, so I've got that glued back up. The next area where they do not provide a lot of detail, and I think it's going to be up to you as a builder, is how much detail you want to do on the cannons. So on the top deck, I'm going to try to go to the extreme. And I've got a couple samples here that I've gotten started. So obviously I'm going to tie the barrel in with this loop to the frame of the ship and then I'm also going to have some rigging uh, with some spare lines sitting off to the side. This is very time consuming and difficult to make so that's what slowed me down. But I've got some helpful hints and let me use this cannon as an example. Some of the details that I've decided to add this little cap on top and I experimented around a little bit and you could actually take a small dowel rod and file it down flat and then file out a little lump with a like a rat tail and you could make this out of wood and I may show that as an example because I do not have enough of these metal ones so I'll show that later it's a little uh, time consuming but it can be done. I purchased these separately. I was going to nail them in but it is so intricate work it, it was not worth the hassle so I just glued them on and from a distance the, the holes in it for the nails kind of look like nail heads anyway. Now I'm just going to do that on the top deck as well as a lot of this rope work. Something that I've discovered that is helping out immensely is that I put a nail through this and then it'll be through the ship you can see a nail hole here and that will hold that cannon perfectly in place I've always struggled getting them in place and it ends up I mess up with the glue now in my case I set this up on my drill press and pre-drilled all of these holes I don't have them glued in so I could push down and actually pull that nail out. And when you put the cannon barrel in place, it completely, completely hides the nail. And conceivably, I don't need to glue that in and it would give me a little mobility to turn the cannon if I want. So that's worked out very well. The issue I have is when I'm doing the lower deck, I need to get these in place before I put the upper deck on and that is before I start doing the um, planking. Well, I don't want these sticking out because I'll, I, I know for a fact I'll bump into them and snap them off. What I think I can do is put this in place, maybe put just a dab of glue on the nail. That will allow the cannon cart to turn on the nail but it'll prevent it from falling out when I turn the ship sideways or upside down or whatever I do. There's one of the cannon carts in place and I could take the cannon from outside the window. This is later on in construction. And from the outside, put that exactly where it goes. I could just put a little adhesive on the, uh, the cannon struts or whatever you would call those. And I think that will work so I can get all of those uh, carts in place without the cannons. Another area where I've gone into detail is I put like a little brass pin to hold the wheels on on every cart. Some of them I will make shorter by just taking some nail clippers and clipping off the ends. And I, I just decided to try and do it. Once I got started I just went ahead and did it on all of them. Very labor intensive. I don't know that you want to go to that extreme. You might just want to glue those wheels on. But uh, that's what's been taking me so long.
but I do have all the Canon, I'll call them Canon carts constructed, but I've got a lot of work on getting these uh, supports to hold the Canon in place, Trunnion I think it's called, and then these little uh, eye, eye hooks, eye posts in place for the rope that holds the barrel from shock and then the rope work uh, pulley system to pull the cannon back up to the to the ship. So that brings you up to date on where I stand on building the Black Pearl. It doesn't look like I've completed a lot, but I've spent a lot of time on those cannons. As always, thanks for watching.